why is this all about fat? This is what you people do in school, fat. High school was a really dark time for me. Hello, Joel. This is your number one Ghana girl, Jojo, bringing you awesomeness straight from Ghana. Oh, yeah. Take it. This episode of Drink If is going to be a teenage dirt bag edition because I'm just a teenage dirt bag baby. I'm such an Oreo. My niece is done with high school recently and it's got me reminiscing about, you know, life in high school. So I asked her, I don't think I've even gone through the list. I asked her to do a list of Drink If instances that we can do we're supposed to do it together but she's not comfortable on camera so shout out to my niece for coming up with the list ah. if you haven't subscribed yet please subscribe grab a glass fill it with wine water tea so below milo corona did i just say corona smell of ice you know whatever you have and let's play a lovely game of drink if today i'm drinking iced tea it's been in the fridge for some time this is chai tea Apparently, chai means tea, so saying chai tea is just saying tea tea. Mm. Smells amazing, by the way. I drink it alone. I drink it with people. Regardless, you're with me, so you're never alone. I need sugar. Just a little sugar. I don't know if this is ASMR or round one. Why is this all about fat? This is what you people do in school, fat. Drink if you've kept your fat in in class. I think I have. I probably have, but I don't remember. It's okay. Drink if you've released a fart in class and got caught once. But it wasn't in high school. It was in class 5, grade 5, whichever one works. Drink if you've ever been stolen from. My first night in school, someone stole my cowbell, that son, the one in that son. And she wrote her name on it and put it in her bag. And we all knew it was her. But like, how do you go and claim your cowbell? I can't believe I still remember this. I have been stolen from. Drink if you've ever stolen from someone. Oh, hell no. I haven't. But if you have no judgment here, drink if you've ever picked a fight. I don't think I have picked a fight. Okay, so there was this one time I was talking to my boyfriend in school. Yes, I had a boyfriend in high school. Hi, we were in the school around on the field somewhere. And this girl was talking to And she was being very friendly i did not understand you have no business being friendly to my boyfriend right to my face like that so i smacked her hand she didn't fight back can we call that picking a fight i don't know i'm a drink to that if yes if you've picked a fight drink if you've won any of those fights i'm a lover not a fighter is your drink done please refill Let's move on to round two. Drink if you've ever thought of exchanging your mother for someone else's mother. Jessica, what are you going through? What made you write this? I mean, sometimes, you know, during visiting, nobody comes to visit you and then maybe somebody's mother comes to visit them. So yeah, maybe you would have been jealous in that respect. I say visiting because when we, most of us in high school went to boarding school. So maybe there are people that went to day school. So yeah, I've never wished that. Drink if you've ever confronted someone who hurt you. No, I haven't confronted anyone who hurt me. Oh, wait, I have. I, I have. High school was a really dark time for me. So in honor of that, I'm just, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna change the lighting. Hold on, give me a minute. Drink if you have confronted someone who hurt you in high school. Teenagers, do we have any business being in relationships? Because aren't we supposed to be like focusing on school and studying? I had problems with my boyfriend in high school. And there was this girl. She got close to me in pretense of wanting to help me fix my relationship. I found out after school that all along she just wanted to herself. And she wasn't really trying to help me. She was just trying to get some. So moral of the story, don't trust people i don't know because it got me nowhere so and if i had the chance i would have confronted her when i found out but we are kids drink if you've ever peed yourself while laughing of course who hasn't drink if you have cheated during an examination i mean in an exam hall not like when you see a gynecologist or something who hasn't drink if you've never cheated in an examination hall.
oh, you drink because I know that you're a good person and you've never cheated during an examination. Drink if, as a teenager, you've ever run away from home. I have, but I wasn't a teenager, so. Is your glass empty? Is your drink done? Refill. Let's go for the final round. Round three. Drink if you stuck gum under a table in school or wherever. I don't think I've done that before. But for you who's done it, I'm going to drink to you. Drink if you've ever written on walls. I was here so. <laughs> I've never done that before. On walls, on tables. Like, why did you people do that? I mean, granted, it really like showed us that people have been here before us and really like didn't alienate we the new students into the school. So it sort of humanized the buildings and the tables and stuff like nothing is perfect in school. I don't know if this makes sense. Let me know. Did you write on furniture? Did you write on walls in school? Did you? Did you? I didn't. Except if I was writing notes on a blackboard. I'm gonna drink to that. Drink if you had before you turned eight. Cool. I didn't have sex before I turned 18. But for you who had sex before you turned 18, I am going to drink to you. Drink if you've ever given in to peer pressure. How I don't remember. I don't remember. Drink if you've ever been to the disciplinary committee in high school. Oh, what did I do? You're asking. Um, I kissed a boy. I haven't told this story before. I don't know if I should tell it right now. Asterisk proceeds to tell the whole story in five minutes. Like for foreign people, DC disciplinary committee would probably be like going to the principal's office. Wow, I need a drink after that. And of course, the last one, if you have any drink left in your cup, drink if you enjoyed playing this game with me. Chug, 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 chug. Is the tea making me drunk? Nope. This is not it for me. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this Teenage Dirt Bag edition of drink if i don't know how you found this video i don't know what brought you here today tonight this afternoon this dawn but i will always have a virtual hug waiting for you and i hope that whatever you're going through you get through it and you will be okay don't ask me how i know you'll be okay and i have a virtual hug for you so with your consent of course let's go Thank you so much for watching. If you haven't already, please subscribe. It goes a long way to help me spread positive vibes when you can. And go forth and be awesome. Juju. I'm out. Yeah.